<laughs> so people are going to get upset with that. I don't give a fuck. I don't really care. Have I ever given a shit? No one wants to be Peter Chris Lois, not even Peter Chris. What's going on, everybody? This is Trend Kill Radio, a rock news show about all things rock, except for when it's not. Brought to you by Tesla Motors and Raid Ant Farm Repellent. It's been so long since we've done a show. It's been a fortnight. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I bought a house, so here's the new studio. Pictures to come. Don't worry about it. That'll be on Instagram at Trend Kill Radio 216. Yeah. Hi, I'm Sean Ryan. And I am Coley Colgate. How are you? Happy 2023. Oh my God, I can't believe we're already here. We were actually going to do this even earlier, but yeah. then I got the Rona. The Rona. It's still a thing. I know. <laughs> Who would have thunk three years later? It could be chlamydia. I don't know. It was very itchy. It burned I, when I peed. That that sounds like chlamydia. I was told it was COVID. It could be gonorrhea as well. Syphilis. Whoops. Uh, any number of things. Speaking of crotches. Mm. Um, tonight's story, we have Alien Ant Farm. I know everybody's, like, favorite band. We've been pining to know about Wait, it's going. We can't just jump into the news yet. Okay. Now we can jump into the news. So, yeah, our, uh, favorite bug band. I won't say favorite. What, what's another bug band? Papa Roach would be my favorite. Oh, favorite bug band Wasp. would be. Yeah. Come on. There's Shit, a ton, dude. actually. There's probably more than we... Can think of. Anyway, so America's third favorite bug band, <laughs> Alien Ant Farm, uh, they've gotten into a little bit of trouble, but it couldn't be better for this guy's career. Yeah. Alien Ant Farm singer Dryden Mitchell. Dryden? I did not know that was his name. All these years, I don't I don't know what I thought it was. I didn't think it was that, though. Yeah. <laughs> Dryden. The sound of your voice makes me dried. It's not moisten. What didn't? <laughs> <laughs> he has been charged with battery and a misdemeanor following a recent concert incident where a fan was trying to do this obnoxious thing where everybody they they go and try to do this. Yeah, and get a selfie with him while he's on stage, yeah. and he proceeds to kind of give the guy a little high five from the stage, and uh, you know, pulls it towards his crotch. And Why are you rock hard. <laughs> I'm excited. It's a new year, <laughs> a new, new show. Yeah, new show. Okay. <laughs> Impressive. But yeah. Just <laughs> he just brought it right on into his crotch. It was only like a second. It wasn't like a, a sensual moment or anything like that. But it was weird as fuck. And you know, here we are now talking yeah. about it. Why don't we just take a look at the video? Here it is. And this incident, I love a good uh, crotch grab. I'll, I'll just let you know. I know, and that was nothing. Back in our day, back in our day, Marilyn Manson used to rub his sweaty nutsack on security guards' heads all the time. Sure did. Sure did. He used to do that all the time. Yeah. Now these kids are too sensitive these days. They can't handle another man's penis in their hands. Right. And I don't think that. I, you know what? You should be. You should be ashamed of yourself. You, you should be grateful mm-hmm. that Dryden. Grab your hand and put it down his crotch. Yeah. Near it. Yeah. Just to kind of graze it a little. You know? Uh-huh. Snowflake generation. You Bunch guys of pussies. Make, make me sick. Make me sick. Make me sick. Imagine, if you will, you're, you have that opportunity to touch a dick and, and you're refused. <laughs> what if he wanted to touch That's his what dick? I'm and, yeah, and the singer was like, no. Nah. Yeah, that, I'd be pissed. I'd be like, let me touch your dick. Yeah. I know. People ask us that all the time when we're out. Yeah. We gladly oblige. Typically, it's usually just you or Jim asking me, and I do it. Uh, I know my place here on the show. (laughs) So this incident actually happened before Halloween. This was on the 29th, and of of course, states of all states, Florida. Florida. Fort Lauderdale. (laughs) And then uh, around November 14th, the guy went to the police and made uh, Yeah, a couple weeks after the fact. I think the video... 
uh, which was taken from obviously further back in the crowd, must have gone some kind of viral or been shared around the greater Fort Lauderdale area <laughs> among the uh, alien ant farm circles and uh, oh, the colonies, the ant colonies, if you will. <laughs> and, uh, you know, he probably saw it, probably got made fun of, and then eventually went to the police uh, and filed a report. Yeah, around November 15th, he, uh, the Miami unnamed resident had gone to the Fort Lauderdale Police Department. He's so embarrassed. Just call just, him Florida, man. Jesus, Louise. That's just so weird. Like, are you that embarrassed, or are yeah. you that much of a homophobe, or like? <laughs> One of he, he said it, he said it took him so long because it just it built up and it you know it just didn't sit right with him. And then you know it would bother him because you know there, there was also children in the audience, and it's like, well, I mean, like if you get it, he was doing this move while he was singing "Smooth Criminal." Yeah. And what was Michael Jackson known for doing? Raping children. The kid in me likes the frosted side. But the grown-up in me likes the kid in me. Yes, but to a lesser extent, grabbing his crotch. <laughs> oh! And the crotches of children. Yes, uh, not Macaulay's and not Corey Feldman's, though. That's true, I did read that. They're always the nobodies. Yeah. Yeah, you know. The Coley Colgates of the world. <laughs> <laughs> you been to Neverland? I, I would have been a victim. <laughs> I've never been, though. <laughs> I know. You know, bad things happen to people. Mm -hmm. It's true. Yeah. So that dude's hand was struck Molested. by... Molested. A smooth... Crim genital. Genital. Smooth <laughs> <laughs> oh, genital. <laughs> Just to wrap it up, the Boward State Attorney's Office filed a first-degree misdemeanor charge against the alien ant farm vocalist, Dryden. Uh, on December 30th, uh, Mitchell has yet to be booked for the battery charge because they went like... Yeah. I'll just type it up on my invisible typewriter. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Fruit cake. I'm assuming they're not from there. We'll hunt them down for you. Right. Yeah. We'll get Dog the Bounty Hunter in on it. I think isn't he based out of Florida? Probably. It he, would make sense. He looks like it. He very much does. Yes. Doesn't he? What's that other Alien Ant Farm song? Movies. Yeah. Yeah. That wasn't that, that wasn't too bad. No, I don't remember anything else. By I the just way. like the movies. Mm -hmm. na, na, na. Do, 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 do. I love, I love what you're See, I was singing that in my head, <laughs> and I kept on thinking of that life house. Go wherever you wanna go. That's the calling. That's life house, though. No, right? that's the calling. The calling? Yeah, from their seminal album. Call don't <laughs> don't talk about semen on this show. <laughs> Calo Paramino or something like that. I don't remember. Pinot cool. Grigio? No, that's a wine. Oh. Look at us. Nothing like a good old-fashioned crotch grab. Yep. Get back out there. <laughs> uh, that is all for us today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to subscribe. Hit that like button. Be sure to share, like, subscribe. That's what gets us going in the algorithms and stuff. And we don't just, like, and drop off after a few days. In the pants. It gets <clears throat> going in the pants as well. It does. It gets me moist. And, uh, yes, and be sure to follow us on Instagram at Trinko Radio 216 I don't have anything else to say either, except I love you. Love you, too. All right. I'm your host, Sean Ryan. And I'm Cole Cole. And this has been Trend Kill Radio. Radio. New Trend Kill merchandise that you can't buy. Yeah, exclusive stuff. Yep. <laughs> What a dick. Captain. <laughs> <laughs> you like it, you can't have it. <laughs> Tough. That is sick, though. Thank you. That is sick. Florida man, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Florida man? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs>